Go Fest, Roanoke, Virginia. Coming up here to see Jeff Lanoski do his show. Wander through the bike demo section for a second. See what we got. Yes. Animal friendly, kid friendly, bike friendly, outdoor friendly. Trailer, camping trailer. Oh, I'm Jeff Lenoski, son of a gun, that dude's tall. Dude, look how tall that cat is, man. Hey, hey. How's everybody doing this afternoon? Good? Are you having fun at GoFest? Woo! My name is Jeff Lenoski. I'm a professional mountain bike rider for Giant. I travel all over the country doing mountain bike trials demonstrations like this, filming for my YouTube channel. How many of you have ever checked out some of my videos on YouTube? And doing competitions, all kinds of group rides, things like that. So this afternoon, I'm going to do a mountain bike trials demonstration. I've been coming to Go Fest for quite a while. How many of you have ever seen me do a demo here at Go Fest? All right, about half of you. So the first thing with mountain bike trials, you have to have really, really good balance. So like I said, it's not about going far or fast. So the first thing you need to learn to do is just balance your bike in place. Looks like all you guys are bike riders here, right? You know the faster you go, the, the better your bike balances. We need to learn to balance it in a standstill. So that's why when you get up on these obstacles, you can plan your next move. And then the same way you take your finger and you put it on your nose, that's what we have to do with our wheels. So we have to be able to walk our bikes right where we want it. So when we get up on these obstacles, we can plan our moves and make them. All right, let's turn around here. Go over here. And we'll get started on the lowest obstacle I've got. This is right here. And now you can see why balance is really important. If I didn't have it, I'd fall right down to the ground. And then I'm planning my next move. I know I want to go here. Like that, like that. So, can you guys see why balance is really important? There we go. And then we'll go here. There you go. So, the trial is really. All right, let's go over here. We'll go over here. Let's get turned around up here. There we go. What do you think of that? And then again, you can see why that balance 
it is really important. Are you good? I'm up here, gonna plan my next move. I'm gonna go right here. There we go. Sidebars. Now I'm gonna go right down the center. You guys gotta give me a tiny bit of room right there. Perfect, perfect. We're probably gonna end up getting nice, nice and personal on this one. All right. So, getting set. One, two, and then here. Really close. Not a lot of room out here. Okay, you get set. Back pedal. There we go. And then walk the plank right here. Right. What do you guys think? So let's see. One wheel? Alright, one wheel. Here we go. We got room for this one. I'm gonna get close to you guys right here. There we go. All right. What do you guys think of that? All right. You know the drill. You're gonna lay on the ground on your back, and you're gonna be a human log or a speed bump or whatever. Okay. Go like this. Make yourself nice and skinny. What's your name, Tyler? Let's hear it for Tyler, everybody. So we're going to practice a bunch of the stuff that I just did. Now we're going to do them over the top of Tyler. Does that sound cool? So this ground is kind of similar to riding on a wet carpet. So it makes it a lot harder. But I always get this right at least half the time. So we should be in good shape. All right. You take <laughs> Uh, it's a show, so work with me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right, now, the 180 that I did over there, now I'm going to do over the top of Tyler, okay? Let's see you guys. One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. Stunt, which you saw earlier, right? All right, you guys want to see a few more things? You want to see something big or do you want to see something really, really technical? Yeah. Nobody ever says technical, so that's cool. I'm going to show you something really technical and then I'll show you a couple big things, okay? All right. I'm about to get really close to you right there. All right. So, I want to do, can you get to it? There we go. Now let's see. Instead of using this whole thing. Oh. Well, so the plan was to ride up this balance beam and I just screwed it up. Now I'm going to make it even harder. And I'm going to try to ride down this one, which is even skinnier. What do you think? So I said when I started, you have to have really good balance. When you do mountain bike trials, this is about as tough as it gets. My tire is 2.2 inches. That's two inches wide. I'm gonna try to start here, ride to that box. What do you think? Right. For this one, just a little golf flap is good. Okay. I'm gonna get set. I'm try to ride my tire onto there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What do you 
you that one. All right, so let's see. Go right here. So that trailer's about seven feet four inches tall. This box is about five, six, so this is a good warm up right here. Wanna see me drop straight to the ground? Or is that too easy? Too easy. Too easy, right? Too easy. Can I throw in a 360? Too easy. Alright. There's no room here. So I can go right here. So just scoot back a tiny bit. Not too far though, because if I screw up I like soft stuff to land on. So Alright, is everybody ready? Here we go, guys. So I'm gonna do it off of my front wheel. All right, let's get a countdown from five. Five, four, three, two, one, go! There we go. You know, this, all right. What's your name? Uh, let's hear it for Keegan, everybody. Remember also what I did during the first show? So when I get up there, then I'm going to give you the cue, and we're going to also do that, okay? All right. So, back up to the roof of the trailer. Tegan's going to give you a really good reason to get nice and loud, and then we'll do that drop. Does that sound good? Right. Tegan, I'm halfway. Wait for me. You doing all right down there? Oh, all my water bottles fell down. And the really cool thing about Trail Boss is three of my favorite episodes I filmed right here in Roanoke. I'm just stalling before I do this drop, okay? How many of you have ever ridden or hiked Rattlin' Run? All right, so that was probably my favorite episode. And then there's also a great trail over there called Royalty. There's another one called, uh, what's the other one called? Oh, Gauntlet, right, and Gauntlet, so so those are three of my favorite episodes and they're right here in your hometown and I love filming those videos where people that actually ride those trails can see them. All right, is everybody ready? All right, and, all right, go. Eight, seven. so much everybody. Is that scary? It was scary for me. Alright, thank you so much everybody. I have another show at 4 o'clock. Everyone's a little bit different, so make sure you come back. If anybody wants a free autograph poster, we'll do them right over here. I also have stickers and t-shirts. Thank you so much everyone. I can take both of his feet off and kick him to one side. Come on, they're not even halfway through, Rowan Oak! Oh, Billy with a big setup there for you. Huge nothing. Letting go of his hands and his feet. Bike just sailing in the wind. They're trying to let these tricks get difficult. They're trying to hear you out here. Whoa, no way. Jared with a tail whip, 360. Kicking the bike all the way around while he's spinning. These guys are trying to bring it for you guys. Whoa, no. Nice. Toboggan 360. Put a little more on a strider bike. Don't have pedals. Yeah.
But you know, we never I didn't know you didn't have it locked. Just dreams it. See this little boy right here? Uh -huh. No pedals. You know, I've been to over 25 okay. countries just for BMX bike riding. Really cool, awesome places. Places I didn't even know where they were on a map until I got invited there. Come straight all the way across the pool. 